Hey guys, so here I'm going to show you how to do record keeping. So for starters, you have tasks, fields, and notes, and then underneath you have glossary. But for now, we will go to tasks. So you can see on the task page, you have three statuses in progress, open, and done. At the top, you can see that you can filter your task. So for instance, if we go to open, um, you can filter your task by the dates. You can filter your task by the type of task. So if we only wanted to see fertilizing, then we will see fertilizing. If we want to filter it by the field, so I believe we have alpha as our field, then the task will show up for field alpha. Remember, if you select a field where the task has not been assigned to, like Bravo, for instance, then nothing will show up. So remember to be careful where you assign your task to. And if you ever get lost in any of this, you can just press the X icon on the far right, and it will allow you to reset all filters. Do not worry, data will not be deleted, but... This is just to help you organize your information. And you can also organize your task by the worker. So you can select myself, and then you'll see that both tasks show up. And if you select a worker like Sam, then those tasks will not show up because that individual was not assigned to those tasks. So again, we set all filters. Now, if you want to add a new task, you just simply press the plus button. Here you can choose a task from the list. And if your task is not on the list, then you can select other. But for now, we will choose planting again. And here you see your three fields um, that we already have. If you want to add a new field, you can press plus and you can either import it use GPS measurement or draw it but for now we will just choose one of the current fields we have I will select Charlie for now and once you selected your field you can just press the save icon now you can see that if we want to edit our task we have planting at the top and you can also edit the status so you can put it as open in progress or as done uh, for now we will just say that it is in progress and also have your fields at the bottom and if you want to add more information to this task for starters you also have notes that you can add but let me just hit the back button one second um, you can also go to plus here you can add information about the workers machinery materials you use uh, tracks or fields so for now we will choose a worker so right now we will add bill our worker to this task if you want to create a new worker you can just hit the plus button um, type in their name and position and then press save um, so right now we added bill and we can add more information if we like but just pressing the plus button so for instance we can go to machinery and we can select one of the vehicles provided or we can add a new vehicle by pressing plus you can go to vehicles or to implements but if you want to add a new vehicle i recommend selecting vehicle and here for your tractor you can type in the type and model the width and the year and once you are satisfied you can just press save but for now i'm just going to use one of the tractors on the list so I will select John Deere. And once you have selected your tractor, just select the check button at the top. Okay, so now we have for this task planting, we have machinery, John Deere, workers, myself, and it is for status in progress. If you were not happy with this task um, and you want to delete it, you have to select the three dots that are in a row or in a column, I mean, and this will allow you to delete the task. And once you want to save your task, you are satisfied with all your information, 
select the X, and this will show up. Um, remember, we put it as in progress, so not open, but in progress. And do not be scared if you do not see it. Um, all the information is in a filtered view, so you have to first reset all your filters. And by resetting your filters, select OK. And then your task planting will show up. Um, at the top here, you have a map icon, a filter icon, and a search icon. If you select the filter icon, which is in between the map and the search, um, the filters go away. So you can see tasks that are open, tasks that are in progress, and tasks that are done. So right now we will go to the map icon. Here you'll see your fields. And also, so we will see right now we have fertilizing and planting. and if we want to go to the filter icon, um, remember to select the X. And if you reset all filters, you can see that um, yeah, everything gets cleared. So you can filter a task by any, you any you type you like. So we'll go to planting. That way you see only planting arrives. And if you want to filter it even more by field, you can do Charlie. Again, if you select the wrong field and you select Alpha, then nothing will show up. So I select Charlie, and you can filter it by a worker. So we'll do Bill. And if you want to clear all filters, simply press X, reset all filters, select OK, and then everything is back to normal. And if you want to go back to the normal view, just simply press the um, icon to the left of the filter and it will bring you back to the animated list view. Thanks everyone for watching and feel free to subscribe to our channel for more videos and tips.